the urgency of tonight's Game 4. Hi, everybody. I'm James Cebulski. Welcome back to EA Sports' continuing coverage of the playoffs. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz of this city all day long. And we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Slides the puck over. The Jets gain the zone. Now a quick pass to Pion. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. big part of his squad scoring when he gets going with his game. Connor's foot speed can make him dangerous, and that's his wheel zone ability. I'm expecting one of these two players to give their team the edge tonight. Guys, back to you. Gains the zone along the right wall. And that's knocked away by Morrissey. Tries to get it over to Ehlers. Great reach with the poke check. And that's blocked in traffic. Great reach by Pion. Here they come on the attack. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Dished on over to Thomas. Big play inside the defensive zone. And he can't hang on after that hit. Moves it quickly over to Velarde. Cruz moving the puck through his own zone. St. Louis has it against the half wall. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Hayes. Nice dish to the left wing. Excellent stick work on the play. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. St. Louis has it in their own zone. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Puck picked up by DeMello. Poked away in the neutral zone by Falk. Picked up along the wall by DeMello. And now he moves it quickly to Velarde. Great poke check on the reach. They fight for it along the boards. From the top of the offensive zone here. It's in the back of the net. They get up by one, and gotta wonder if it now opens the game up. Sunfist gained possession inside the neutral zone. Folks got it along the line. I know it sits on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. And lowers the boom with a big time hit. Wow, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from Buck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. Still lots of time left in the period. The Jets lead it 1-0. Plays won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. And he slides it quickly to Torchenko. The Jets gain possession. Feeds the puck up to Lowry. Here we go, pucks in deep. Finnington's last save was so impressive, James. Really a last-ditch effort to find the puck. When you out-battle, when you out-will your opponent, everyone around you gets energized. Just look at the bench. Everyone is elevated because of that save. Gets it to the other point. Plays exploring options with the puck. And he takes a shot. Oh, he had a struggle with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Here we go, look at this here. Really a part of the squeeze down in the offensive end. The Blues take the puck through the neutral zone. The Jets gain control of the puck. Moves it to the offensive zone. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Takes the feed. And he gets just enough to keep it out. 
And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. one nothing the score. Winnipeg's won the draw, they'll go to work. Makes the glove stop. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Both teams gliding into position and the official set to drop the puck. And they win the faceoff and set up to go on the attack. Denies it in front. Bennington styled in and able to redirect that puck to the corner. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Winnipeg tied activity in the offensive zone has resulted in them leading here midway through the first. The frozen risk gets dropped and we are back in the way here. Puck sent over to Shen. Picks up the puck. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Here they come up along the wing. The Jets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Quick feed to Ewers. Denies him on the play. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Buchnevich. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Broken up by Pion. Solid check to slow him down. Moves it on over to Ayafalo. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Aya follows, got it against the boards. Feeds it down low. Puts it on there. Oh, he stopped it. What a save on the play. And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. St. Louis has it near the wall. Tries to feed it over to Perfetti. Tries to make a move and the puck hops away. Perfetti's got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one and the puck dies on the stick. Moves the puck. And he turned that one aside. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Hellebuck's known for getting in the groove when he faces a lot of shots, guys. His workhorse zone ability means he stays engaged to give his team a chance to win. Off the base, off, they take the puck. Feeds it to Nemestikov. Poked away by Falk. Shot, turns that one away. Quick pass to Neighbors. Strong defensive effort. Scooped up along the wall by Dillon. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Taken along the wall by Perfetti. Winnipeg's across the blue line. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Kapanen's got the puck in his own zone. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Across the line from center. Shot! Oh, what a save in front! Sends it down low. Centering feed! And that's stopped! Takes the puck behind the net. and they've held possession, and it's the reason why they have a majority of shots on goal, and they've been rewarded for their efforts, James. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Well, that brings it into period number one. Still lots more action to go. Both teams will recharge and be back with more on ice action in the second in no time. are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. 
Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. St. Louis is behind after 20 minutes because they haven't managed the puck, and it comes down to their pass execution. When you're not connected and you're not taking take-to-take -take passes, guess what? You're not ahead. Taken by Connor. Winnipeg's in now. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Now the shooter's gonna run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Poked away by Morrissey. Moves it to Ayafalo. Niederreiter's got the puck. Here's a chance! Still plenty of time left in this frame. Winnipeg's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Kairou's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Looks to get the puck over to Falk. Uses the force on that hit. St. Louis takes hold of the puck. Scores! It's in the back of the net! Well, he had his eyes on the puck. He tracked it perfectly and got himself set to position, James. I thought he had it. He got a good chunk of it, but he didn't get it all. St. Louis has served up a major counterpunch here in period number two. And it's all about trusting your preparation, James, and that's exactly where they are in the second. They're finding a way to have good habits, and they're rewarded by getting themselves within one. Forces the turnover. Feeds it over to Niederreiter. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Puts it in deep. Winnipeg's got the puck. Feeds the puck across to Malardi. Along the side, here they come for the neutral zone. Shot! Oh, great save right there on the play. Works it across to Letty. And he slides it quickly to Kapanen. Winnipeg's got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Appleton. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Puck clears the zone and they'll be forced to regroup. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Moves the puck across to Sundvist. Here's a short pass to Saad. Fantastic save! Hellebuck's all over that save. I mean, he's dialed in and he recognizes where he has to be at the right time. Sends a pass over. Oh, what a stop on the play. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. Great save on the play. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. They got a face-off coming up here in the offensive end. And the goaltender looks fatigued, James, so the best medicine right now for them is to find a way to put the puck to the net. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. The Jets have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. And they win the draw on their own end. Directed over to Connor. Takes the pass. Lock jam and Fred Lewis runs it up. Scores! Kyle Connor doing what he does best. Well, that's a great play in tight, James. The way he gets body position and then just slides that ball in the end underneath the puck on the back end. The Jets continue to dictate the play here tonight. They've now gone up by two in the second. Yeah, their play is reflective on the scoreboard, and that's not always the case, but they've had the majority of the shots in this one, James. They continue to put pucks to the net. I expect that number to go up. Puck grabbed by Pion. 
goes right to the crease. Denies him. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Morrissey. The Jets take it along the wall. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Trying a nifty move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied, and that's what happened there. Quick feed to Lowry. Knocked away by Shen. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. And the puck's not loose. Sends it in front. Oh, and he couldn't handle the pass because he was knocked off target. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Pareko. Here's a shot off target. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. The Blues get a hold of it. Sends it quickly to Shen. All alone. Makes a save. Oh, and this is a great save. You can see this one-on-one -on -one battle. And the goaltender is so dialed in, tracking, and makes that save. Past the midway mark of the frame. The Jets are up 3-1. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. The Blues have the puck in the corner. Quick pass to Neighbors. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Winnipeg's working hard in all areas of the ice. Defense is structure and it needs to happen in all three zones when you're talking about Positioning, they're doing a great job of taking away passes. Both teams are set, they're ready to drop the puck. Winnipeg's gonna start with the puck in their own end. And it's a quick pass to Niederreiter. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Here's a shot! with it, right? He's got to read where the goaltender is and he's got to hit the back of the net. The Jets are showing no signs of slowing down and here we are in the late stages of period number two. They continue to hit down the accelerator. Yeah, and the coach must be loving this. I mean, sometimes you can't put your finger on exactly why it's working the way it is, but the chemistry is off the charts here and they've got to come to the lead. And that's a great heads-up play by Neighbors. St. Louis plays it along the wing. been really sharp tonight, James, and then just have a look at his save percentage, and he's making the stops that he needs to. The man, his team's played well. They brought going north, they've created opportunities, and a reason why they have a healthy lead. Here in the late goings of the period, Winnipeg's been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. The Jets will play it from the defensive zone. Great hits up play with the stick by Scandella. Right in the open ice, that one's picked off. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Here we go, on man rush. Puck scooped up by Kapanen. Oh, what a great save by Hillebuck. I love the way that he battles and competes for this puck, James. I mean, he loses it for a second, then he finds it, and he makes the save. There's a collision. Sends the pass over. And now he tries to get it across to Hayes. Rocked on the play. Dismissed that chance. Shen's the leader of this team, and who do you look to when you're down? You find a way to look to your leaders. They create momentum. Everyone jumps on board. This game is not out of reach yet. Connors lugging the puck. Oh, my, you can feel that from here. Well, that has to hurt, and he's getting up slowly. The whole body rattles when you get hit like that. Takes a shot, and that's stopped by Bennington. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Dumps the puck in. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. And a poke check knocks the puck away. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. 
Hawks one of those goaltenders that the busier he gets, the more efficient he becomes. And it's save after save as his confidence grows and he's more dialed into the game. Well, there you go. We played 40 minutes. Final chance for the coaches to push their messages home. And we'll see the third period coming up in just a matter of moments. assessment so far. St. Louis needs to find a way to make better decisions with the puck, James. They just force play all over the ice, and as a result, they turned it over way too many times. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. The Jets take possession in the defensive end. Moves it to Morrissey. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Puts it on this. Scores! They strike it! The Jets continue to attack the net here in period number three, adding yet another goal to their score. Well, it's been all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight, James. I've also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice, not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, they're creating all over the ice, and it's been real fun to watch. Picked off by Kapanen. Moves it quickly over to Hayes. Comes up with a stop. There's another stop. And another stop. They made some consecutive saves there. He's got to be wondering where his defense are. I mean, how about a little help? Now a quick pass to Ehlers. Connor swooping in on the attack. Shot! Oh, a clutch save! And the puck's booted away. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Pareko. St. Louis has the puck. He's got a step! A great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Lots of time left in this period. The Jets have added to their lead. They're now up by four. St. Louis wins the faceoff. The Blues have it from their own end. St. Louis plays it against the boards. Sends it in front. And that doesn't go as it's off the stick. Can't maintain possession after that hit. And he lays him out with that collision. Here's a short pass to Saad. Poked away at center by Morrissey. Come along the boards. Moves the puck ahead. Slides it diagonally to Saad. And now he moves it quickly to Neighbors. And he takes the pass. Gets the puck in deep. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Can't hang on after that hit. Neighbors takes it into the offensive zone. Centering feed! And that's intercepted. And he slides it quickly to Nemestikov. Here's a chance! Oh, that saved tremendous agility there by Hofer! closer to the midway mark of this period. Winnipeg's put on an excellent display of firepower, leading 5-1. The Jets win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. And the puck leaves the zone. The Jets will play it in their own end. Picked up along the wall by Dillon. Picking up momentum inside the neutral zone. Puck dumped in, and they'll complete a line change. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. Here they are on the attack. Shuts it down with a stop. Quick feed to Thomas. And he takes the feed. What a steal in his own end. Winnipeg. 
Kings been so impressive tonight. They're stealing pucks. They're finding ways to put them in, and it's been a blowout. Coach has got to be impressed. The Jets have it against the wall. St. Louis gains a hold of it. Dishes it to Torpchenko. St. Louis plays the puck along the boards. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Connor. And they turn it over in the neutral zone. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Moves it to Walker. From center, they get into the attacking area. Great pressure with the stick. Takes the feet at the back end. Quick shot. And there's a great save by Hillebuck. Rebound control is critical in the game of hockey. Putting it to the corner, and now the offensive player has to hound the puck. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Oh, he's so good. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Big time stop. Feeds it up ahead. Fast and quick lead pass. And some textbook body contact there. Moves it quickly over to Kairou. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. A chance of shot! Oh, denies him with the paddle save! Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Just here in the late stages of this frame, too much to not enough. It's 5-1. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Grabbed along the board by Morrissey. And now it's grabbed by Hayes. Comes up with a monster save in front. Winnipeg's got it in the own zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Slides the puck to Neighbors. On the attack along the boards. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Winnipeg's got the puck along the boards. Pionk's got it in the defensive end. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Falk's going to play it against the half wall. The Jets gain possession in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. They put the puck into the offensive end. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. The Blues are on the attack. Here's a short pass to Thomas. Oh, what a save in front. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Great chance and an even better save.